Hi, my name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. In my household, there's me, my husband, and our adorable three-year-old little boy. On our channel, you'll find simple and tasty recipes using everyday ingredients. Hey guys, so this time last week we were in Florida visiting Howard's parents and this week we are in Oklahoma visiting my folks. So my mom cooked a big spread. So right back here we have some greens and then she made some rice, got some baked beans and we've got some corn on the cob back here. Over here we have some jalapenos, they have um, cream cheese and they're wrapped in bacon Pink. and then right over here we have some ribs so this is what we're having for dinner tonight and we will see y'all next time hey guys so today is Memorial Day we're still in Oklahoma and we are at my parents former place of employment in the parking lot they had a big Memorial Day bash um, there were, were games and bounce houses, funnel cakes and snow cones, everything was free. Um, so for dinner this day, Howard had a hamburger and a hot dog and I had a pulled pork sandwich. So quick and easy dinner tonight. Um, I made this little salad bar Caesar chopped salad kit from Aldi. Howard and I really like it a lot. And that is, that is Harrison right Hi. underneath my legs. And um, so I boiled an egg and I added that to our salad. And then I also made um, these just bare lightly breaded chicken breast chunks um, that I've had in my freezer for a while. They're from Costco. However, I'm the only one that really eats them. So one way I try to use them up is by making salads with them. And then also I happen to have some red onion. So I added that to the salad as well these are the little hands recording right along with me so this is what we are having for dinner tonight and we will see y'all next time can you say see you next time Harrison see you next time hey guys so for dinner tonight I am using up some stuff that I had in my freezer so I had this artisan flatbread um, that I got from Aldi you get two in a pack but I used one and stuck the other one in the freezer so we're having that I had pepperoni in the freezer and I had this mozzarella in my freezer. These are slices, but they need to be used. And then I have some red onion and then I also have pizza sauce, which I forgot to uh, pull out. Okay, so I just took the flatbread out of the oven and here it is. And I decided to sprinkle some of this seasoning on there before I popped it in the oven. I think I got this from Dollar Tree, I'm not sure. Let me try to show you what's in there. Oh, here it is. Sea salt, garlic, tomato powder, chili powder, paprika, basil, parsley, thyme, and oregano. So we're just I'm just gonna split this in half for Howard and I. And uh, this is what we're having for dinner tonight, and we will see y'all next time. Hey guys, so for dinner tonight, Howard grilled some chicken wings. So we've got a variety of chicken wings, which I'll show you in a second. We have some fresh corn on the cob and Howard is eating mashed potatoes. Let me show you my plate real quick. I'm having the same thing, except I decided to try out and make some mashed sweet potatoes. And I made them the same way that I make my regular sweet uh, mashed potatoes, but I just added some brown sugar, cinnamon, and nutmeg. I will link the video on how I make mashed potatoes in the description box. So here are the wings that we have left over. So right over here, we have lemon pepper wings, and I used this seasoning on them. And then we have just some Creole wings, and I'm using this Tony Sasseries. And then we have jerk wings right here. For the jerk, I used this seasoning and also some of this marinade as well. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight, and we will see y'all next time. 